Good morning, my fellow Nords. It's another Skyrim mod coffee review. I am Gajara, and we are still without Miss Milo for the time being, but I do guarantee she will be back. Just not sure when yet. Um, today we are going to be looking at Andragorn's armory, um, created by Andragorn and ported to Bethesda by Meister B. Let me show you where we are on the map. Okay, we are real close to Bleak Falls Borough, which is, of course, just west of Riverwood, just south of Whiterun, and just northeast of Falkreath. Yeah, your three holds and major plot uh, map point there. Now, I do have one problem with this. I'm going to start off right from the get-go with this particular mod. The map says that the location is right here. You see the little Nordic um, map marker there. But if you look, there is no Nordic ruin here. There's nothing. There's the side of a wall. And uh, what you have to do is walk towards the wall and it just says to Aragorn's armory and you go in. Could have put something there. Um, just a little something. And we are inside. Now, mod author has you going through all sorts of hoops to get everything here you will notice requires key and come in here yeah we go this way there's nothing here that's just a little nothing little nothing catacomb here what you want to do is you want to come, oops, where is it? There it is. Come right in here. And of course, you got your guard here. And you have several merchants. And I mean, one, two, three, four, maybe five merchants. And then a smith over there. Take a look. And if you look, what have you got for sale? Take a look. If you will look, you see that they sell all sorts of things. Pay no attention to the damage. I am fully cheated right now. Until next time. And do pay attention to the price because that's... Until next time. Let's see what that was now. All the way up here to Aaron Talorn Bow. Now he does say that you can smith these if you have the appropriate perks. I you can also find them on bandits throughout Skyrim. I what have you got for sale? Take a look. Some of these weapons actually look marvelous. I love Let's see, um, the great sword, eh, not so much. The long sword, eh, no. War axe, war hammer, war pick. All right then. They look almost the same. Need, need something? But one thing I did find that I thought just looked marvelous. Need some, Was it you? Need Take a look. I shall. Um, I had a battle axe, dagger, longsword. This. Yeah, I gotta see this. And I gotta see that. See ya. The rest of these, I mean, they look good. See ya. What do you come want? up here? Take a look. This guy here, he's got some things. What do you want? Take a look. I mean, that looks okay. Not worth the price. 
What do you need? But the what real catch see? comes right in Take here when you talk to her. What can I do for you? Take a look. And she does have plenty of weapons. They do look cool. Dagger. Long sword. I mean, some of these are hot and others are quite good, but let's see. And there's that mace and that mace again. Now, I love the hilt on that sword. Um, but they are quite expensive. But this is where things come in. There are several rooms, or they saw the cage that I passed on my way in here, but there are three other rooms. And you need these key casts and then I think yeah. what you have to do I didn't check but yeah let's look um, if I were to do this I'd probably put it under miscellaneous Arcane Chambers key cast. And I'm not sure. I'm not sure where I'd find these things. Okay, here we are. Silver ingot. Silver ingot. Iron ingot. Steel ingot. So I need two silvers. One iron, one steel. And he says they should be here, so we're gonna look her. No, those are empty. Yeah. Yeah. Well, if those are empty, where am I supposed to go? It requires a key. It requires a key. Okay, guys. Um, had I known all that, I would have had these ahead of time because nobody seems to sell them. So I think what will happen is I will go get the required items and I will be back. Okay, I am back. I have the required material to create what I need to create. So, come over here. This better be good. Oh, trust me, it's very good. What now? What now? Okay. So now we can create. Our keys. Nice little touch having to create a key, but hey. 
The owner says so, so or the mod author says so, so we yes. do it. Okay. So we come over here, we open the armory. And we have doors that require keys. Oh, I got that key. Arcane chambers. Okay, we have some alchemy ingredients to come and make use of. like a little study area with enchanter and alchemy uh, magic from the sky generic books empty chest empty wardrobe so we got storage in here couple mannequins And a bed. Okay. So we're able to open that door. Can I figure out why this one didn't open? I got made all four keys. Let's see. Archery range. Dagger rack works, which is good. Of course, you got your bed. Oh, suspicious cabinet. Up the stairs. More alchemy. Okay, don't know why we hid that, but hey. It works for me. And that's empty. Fine, we'll just close that. Okay. Little sitting, eating area. Nice big old keg, let's get drunk. Wardrobe empty, little nook. And of course your archery targets. Ready, aim, fire. Looks like somebody's already been practicing here. Okay, so it's an archery range. Still not sure why this one did not work. I got three keys. Okay. So we're gonna head upstairs and there is also the wizarding tower, I think it was called. Yeah, this guy right here Armory storage tower. Oh, 
Okay, there doesn't seem to be a whole lot. A lot of empty storage here, so there's plenty of places to put your things. I can only presume that it's safe storage. But I have no idea why my last key did not work. It was supposed to work. Let me check something here. So my armory casts are gone. Uh, good, good. Dragon bones coming. Yeah, so they're all gone. Abandon, abandon, so archmage, armory, arcane, archery. Oh, it was a forge chest key. Okay. What now? What now? Not that that helped me any, because they're empty. Did she have another cast that I didn't notice? Needs, hi, needs, hi there. Take a look. Nope. I got everything. Huh. Mm -hmm. So we are missing one key. And I'm not sure. Why that door doesn't open. Why did he not provide a key to that door? I don't know. But now, I think it is time we test out the weapons that I did get. Which means I need to go put on some other armor because... We can't do a proper test if I'm fully cheated. So we'll wear that, and that, and that. Take that off. Take that off. Okay. Let's go. We're right here, so I think what we're going to do is we're just going to go to Bleak Falls. I should have respawned by now. Just a couple of issues that I have with the mod so far is a an invisible building I mean there's nothing there you just walk towards the rock and the missing key Now, understand, I am no longer cheated. So, if I die, sorry. I want to use that guy. Yeah, Lucian's had a few updates lately, and they're actually quite funny. Come on, I know you've responded by now. Oh, 
I'm gonna die if I don't get this. Heal yourself. That is that. Okay. Well, I got rid of one of them. Okay, let's try one of these other weapons. Oh. That looks dangerous. <coughs> I'm going to tell you right now, the weapons look actually very nice. And I've only gotten a few of them. There's a whole list load of weapons that were put into this. Um, I think I can get one more before I get too deep in here. Um, let's see, we tried that. Fine, Celentorian sword. Looks cool, but I think I want to try. The bow. Let's see what this does. Um, I'd like to have my dragon uh, just oh he got a war pick I got it for free I need to keep a hold of myself. okay I don't want to go any deeper in this I didn't want to get into a major it was just nearby and thought I'd give it a shot And this way. Now I do like these weapons. They are actually pretty cool. And there's uh, just so many options to go through to um, in the weapons categories. And if you don't want to buy them, you can find them out in the you know, on some of your journeys out there because some of the bandits are carrying them. You know, that's a good thing. Especially if you don't have the money that I have because I happen to have cheat houses all over the place here. Um, still not crazy about the invisible building. And I still don't know where that one key is. You know, all of those issues are still a problem for me. 
But other than that, the weapon selection is actually really good. I like it. And I'm just curious, is there just no way? Yeah, see, there's nothing there. It shows that it's supposed to be there, but there's nothing there. Yeah, I see nothing. Yeah, so that's a big issue with me. And where am I at? Am I? Wow, wouldn't that have been cool? Not have to go through Riverwood just to get up to the mountain. I did not know that you could do it this way. Come on, I lost too many weapons on, or too many arrows on that. Give me my arrows back. Oh, I get four. Okay, anyways. Good Lord, they're just not gonna let me be. Okay, so we know the bow's good. Okay, and I think we're in a safe spot now. Goodness gracious, I need to get somewhere safe. Every time I'm ready to put an end to this, There we go. I know I'm somewhat safe here. This is my home. Okay, guys. So, yeah. Um, Andragorn's Armory. Actually, a nice addition to your collection of weapons. Okay, I think this is good enough. Um, I think you did a pretty good job. Yeah, uh, so you can download this at Bethesda.net. Just look for Andragorn's Armory. I'll have a link down in the description below. Also, if you have missed any of my reviews, I do have a playlist. Um, link is in the description below. And be sure to hit the like, the subscribe, the follow button. We've got videos coming every day. And we will have Miss Milo back with us. At some point, we'll let you know when. Um, comments, they help the channel. They help me with the channel when you put comments on there. And recommendations for the Xbox One console, we will give it a look. And we'll see you with our next review.